And I used to be high every time But it comes back eventually I may tell you that I'm fine So twice a day I see So twice a day I see Hey guys, good morning. So welcome back to a new vlog. As you saw, I just finished my dance class. It was like a replacement class and it was quite fun. I actually just started doing back more intense movement, even practicing my dance a few days ago because I was recovering from vaccine. So now we're getting back on track and honestly, I literally just did yoga here and there only for seven days. That one week can really degrade your process. Yeah, so that was how I felt. Very weak and stamina is just bleh, you know? Oh, also, I just bought oatly oat milk to try because I finished my minor figure ones so I'm just trying to see which one I like best Hello Hey so as y'all know, if you watch my vlogs or if you watch my Ivala episode, you know I absolutely love Mushroom Last Mushroom Rendang. It's vegan and it's so freaking good. One of the best rendang I've had. I ordered it again for this weekend. Just a little treat. I also bought another box as well for Kira and her family because they've been hearing me talk about it a lot and they really want to try it. So I ordered one for them as well. And then I think the girl Aisha, she also gave me this packet of mushroom rendang so I can still have it maybe next week or something <laughs> i can't wait if you haven't tried their mushroom rendang before make sure to go try it it's honestly so freaking good Right now, I have a lot of clothes over here. Also, a lot of new nice dresses over here. Not new, but they are secondhand. So if you are looking to refresh your wardrobe and you want to add some new pieces to your wardrobe, you can definitely go check out. I absolutely love this pastel yellow shorts. It could be an L or an XL. So yeah, there will be a lot of cute t-shirts including this tank top that I used to love but I just don't wear it anymore. So yeah, the agenda for this week is to first do the measurements. I've already washed everything by the way. And then I need to take pictures, post it, and then it's all gonna be good. And then I can finally have more space in my room. The flowers understand that we're fine. So I did some book shopping again because it was 9 9 and I saw that Big Bad Wolf is having a sale. I just really want to get back to reading. It's like a way for me to get away from my laptop or my phone. So I bought some new books and honestly with the Big Bad Wolf sales, it's so worth it. I'm just gonna take out my glasses because it's like glaring through the screen. Now the first one is actually called The Vocationist. To be honest, I got it because the book cover looked quite cute. The story also sounded really interesting in the description box so I got it to read. I don't even know how to describe books, okay? I'll keep you updated on all the books and my thoughts on it. And then the second one is actually this one and the main reason why I got it is because of the color. It's like a really light yellow color. The graphics is so simple and cute. I'm not sure whether it's considered as a young adult book. I'm quite confused but yeah, I got it to read. Yes. Oh, 
，我坐着等着。And then the next one is actually called Two Friends One Summer. I saw the comment in the review section saying that TikTok recommended them this book, so I was like, okay, I'm just gonna get it to read. And then the last one is actually this book by Shirley Jackson. She wrote The Haunting of Hill House. I got these. Not sure what to expect from the inside, but I love the cover. Look at these. They're so cute. If you have any book that you would like to recommend me to get or read, do let me know. I am eyeing on some Colleen Hoover books. I've heard so many great things about them. Like all the YouTubers that I watch, right? They read books, so they kind of inspire me. I honestly used to be such a book reader. Like when my parents go shopping, I would ask to sit alone at NPH and just read. And then after shopping for hours, they'll come and find me. So that was how into reading I was back then. This is another big box of books from Big Bad Wolf as well, but it's not mine. It's actually CDs. He asked me to get some as well, which I'm gonna pass it to him when I see him. But let me just show you what he got. Also, the shipping was super duper fast. Like I ordered on Thursday, and my books arrived on Friday. So quick. He also got a free tote bag. The story of a German legend. Wow, it's so heavy. The rough guide to 21st century cinema. I actually want to read that. It sounds so interesting. The art of the film Watchmen. And I actually find this really interesting and cute. This is called This is Gaugun. Gaugun. Look, there's like three here. There's this one. There's this is Goya. This is Suzanne. And oh, I think I've heard of him before. Famous artists talk about their vision. Ooh, wow. Legendary German cast. Those are all the books that he got. I actually want to read some of them just to flip through. It's so interesting. do like a little coffee chat because I think I found my perfect coffee menu for the beans. I normally use this house blend. It's so so good if you like Arabica coffee. Roasty, nutty, woody. Basically like a latte. Highly recommend this. But today I'm actually gonna try this Sumatra Mandling Triple Pick. I'm kind of nervous but I do have experience drinking Mandling blends before and I like them. So to have the perfect cup of coffee obviously you will need good coffee ground or coffee bean whatever that you are using so find the perfect one until you find it it took me a lot of trial and errors too now if you're a coffee lover latte lover and you want to make foamy foam <laughs> this is the one to go especially if you're looking for a plant-based version so foamy literally even CD said so he tried some normal ones and it just doesn't froth up that nicely but this one wait let me just show you I'll just use another cup I normally eyeball how much I need according to my gut feeling you know now because i don't have like a electronic frother i just use my handheld frother recently i was actually sent this frother by signature market um i did a partnership with them in the previous video and this is so good let me just show you look it's moving up oh my god As of now, this is my perfect coffee and the froth really makes the coffee so much more thicker. This is life-changing, especially if you're on a budget, you don't have a machine for everything. Just do everything yourself. Grind your own beans, get the best bean, and froth it. There we go. So I thought I would just share my little coffee adventure with you. Highly recommend that oat milk though. It's definitely expensive, but if you drink coffee every day and you want to have the best possible results, and it's also cheaper than getting it outside at any cafe, I would say. Oh wow, that is good. It does has like a chocolatey coffee flavor to it though. Oh my god, I'm so happy. <laughs> These few days, I just have been getting all the clothes ready that I would like to sell. I'm just at this mood right now where I just want to clear and just get all these clothes that I don't wear out of my wardrobe. It's quite cluttering for me. Do you see what little chicken? What are you doing at that corner? Can you see the other feet like hanging over there? What are you doing? 
Anyway, this is the current state of my bedroom. It's very backlit right now. I'm actually using this background, basically my wardrobe, as my background for all my photos that I will be taking. I took out all my clothes. I think I have two batches or three because I still need to iron them and wash them and stuff. So if I have over 40 clothes to do at one time, it's quite tough for me lah. So I've decided to separate them into two batches. So this is the first batch. I actually thrifted this last time but sadly, after I got home and I tried it on, it couldn't fit. It's so cute. I love this shot so much. I love the color. But yeah, for more information and updates, you can just follow me on Instagram. It's easier that way because sometimes this vlog, by the time I upload them, you might miss out postings of the clothes. So you can definitely go follow me on Instagram for updates on batch 1 and batch 2.